Hi friends, I'm Ellie and welcome back to Tech Tricks channel. Today I want to show you how to create a fillable form in Google Docs and share it with your friends. In another video, I showed you how to create this fillable form in Microsoft Word that you can find the link in the card and description. Okay, let's see how to create this amazing form in Google Docs. As you know, I want to create this fillable form in Google Docs today. For creating this, I need a header, then I need a table with four columns. As you see here, I have a date picker, a place for applicant image, short answer, and check boxes. So be with me up to the end to make this form. Alright, let's open a blank Google Docs. In address bar, I type in docs.new. A new document opened. I need a fillable form for job application. So I change the title. Now I want to have a shape in the header with the text. So I double click on header section, then on insert tab, I choose drawing and new. With these options up here, I draw my desired shape and I type the text. My shape with the text finished. And I click on save and close. Alright, this is the header. It's time for inserting the table. On insert tab, I select table with four columns and five rows. Let's first do some formatting. I select all cells and right mouse click. Then I choose Table Properties. Then on Alignment, I make it Middle and Center. In the first cell, I want to have Date. I make it bold with Ctrl B and increase the font size to 14. Now in the next cell, I need a Date Picker. Google Docs doesn't have this option yet. But well, you can insert a date. Let's do it. An insert tab, date. As you see, you should select a date. I choose today. Today's date is added. But I wanted the applicant insert the date that filled the application. So I type in a guide under the date. Click on date and choose the date you filled out the application. I make it italic, 11, and dark gray. Okay, it looks good. Under that, I type in name. Again, bold and increase the size to 13. I type a guide. Type in your full name here. Now I want to merge these two cells for inserting the image. So select the cells, right mouse click, and choose Merge Cells. Do it for these cells again. In the first cell, type in Image. Now we need Image Picker, but we don't have this option in Google Docs. So I just insert an image that shows the applicant should inserting an image. I insert tab, Image, Upload from computer. If you click on the image, you can replace it with yours. Okay, in the next row, I want to have phone number and email. Now I want to add a short answer field. I use table again. So I insert tab. Table. I need just one cell. Okay, a cell is added to my table. I will need the right, left, and up border. So I select them with holding Ctrl and click. Then border width, I choose zero. 
I change the down border width to 1.5. Let's create this field for email either. I type in a guide for email too. I use Format Painter for changing the format. In the next row, I merge two cells and type Seeking a Permanent Position. Now I want to have check boxes for answers. Yes and No with check boxes option that you can find it up here in Bullet List and Checklist. For next row, education and answers with check boxes. Do the same for the next row. Employment desired. With full-time and part-time answers. The last question is address. For the address, I need more than one line. So I add a table with three columns and three rows. Then I make the borders invisible. I type in a guide either. Type in your address here. Okay, my application finished. Now I can share it with people and groups. Or I can get the link and send it to the applicants. Alright, you learn how to create a fillable form in Google Docs and share it with others. I suggest you to watch this tutorial either that's gonna help you to create a fillable form in Microsoft Word. Hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up and do subscribe in case you're not subscribed yet. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna see you in the next tutorial.